Preparation work for the summertime. This, this is my, uh, well, this is a money tree. It costs me a lot of money and it's going to cost me an awful lot more money to actually put it right. As you can see, a lot of work has gone, gone, in, gone into the maintenance of this garden. And, um, I've, I've really, tried, really tried hard to keep the overall appearance looking smart well organised. Uh, this is an Aethelus Hippo Castanum. I'm uh, very proud of it. It's uh, coming up two, three years old. Sorry, three years old. I grew it a couple of years back to three years old. Yeah, it's getting on. Um, Just open up the cool. Looking good. This time of year is where we need to have a, a rather high high cut on on the grass in order to prepare it for the winter time, enabling it to uh, possibly survive through the winter months due to um, uh, the, obviously the, the cold coming in and uh, frost can actually kill the grass if it is not above a certain height. Sadly, I didn't lay this part. That's why it's lush green. <laughs> right. Let's go in there. Let's go to the grass or turf or sod, as the correct name for it is. And uh, as you can see here, we have an excellent. E I can't. Words can't describe it. It is absolutely stunning. As you can see, the fine attention to detail on the actual grass itself. You see, when when I lay turf, not 50% of the grass lives. Not 60%, but 80% of it dies. <laughs> you see? I haven't got that technique in order to be, su be successful in my career. But, therefore, I'm just... exactly what I'm thinking. Have you ever required strong, durable structure enabling you to store equipment such as a lawnmower, a strimmer, or other horticultural machinery, <laughs> <laughs> machinery such as a bike? Yeah, that's right, a bike. Anyway, that's very nice, it's my bike, just thought I should mention it. This shelter, you can see. <laughs> number across the bottom of the screen or in the titles at the bottom. Thank you. We built this city. We built this city. Extreme quality of my woodwork. Please see my number across the screen. Yeah. If you would like uh, quality workmanship, work woodwork, if that's the correct word, if that's the correct word or whatever that's come on Jane or back to whatever. Then there's <laughs> Therefore, we can come around your house, measure up, and then realise you've measured the wrong house, and then re-measure, and then we should actually get somewhere. Um, this bit is half finished, and should... Should... <laughs> no, that doesn't want to go up there. We'll leave that for a later time. Um, anyway, let's move on. Oh, <laughs> 